Hey, Brian from Snake Bites here. Today, we make a deal with the devil. You're watching Snake Bites. As you guys know, our snake Satan has become somewhat of a mascot here at Snake Bites TV because of her mean attitude. She's a 16 to 17 foot Burmese python, just has an unbelievably cantankerous temperament. So I thought we'd do a show showing you guys what we do to take care of her. Of course, we have to maintain her just like any other snake, even though she's a little bit more dicey. And as you can see, it's really a group thing. So we're gonna start by the fact that we have to clean her once a week. Just getting her out of her cage can sometimes be a lot of fun. You guys ready for this? <laughs> okay, let's do this. All right. As you can see, as soon as you get her going, she's a little bit sketchy. And you really don't want to be on the business end of that mouth. Trust me, I've been there before. I'm trying to get her just so I can get into her. Once you get her going this way, you guys ready? Yeah, grab it. Okay. All right. This is when it gets really <laughs> dicey. Hey, okay, you guys, you guys got to get her back in for me. Quick, 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 quick. I'm in a bad position here, guys. Okay, you guys get her? All right. She goes into her holding tub. This is where, this is where we hold her we're ready to clean her cage. Typically, George is going to clean her up. It's the normal thing, just changing papers, fresh water. Nothing too special there. It's the next step that I'm worried about. Go ahead, George, get her cleaned up. So you guys got to see everyone working with Satan today and you can see she's really not that friendly of a snake. She's got quite the bad attitude. Now me, I've got a pretty good attitude most of the time, but there are some things that put me in a bad mood and I don't want to deal with anyone. I don't get as mean as her though. I want to know what kind of things put you guys in a bad mood. Leave a comment below and let us know what you think. All right, so Georgie has the cage all cleaned up. Now she's a big girl, so we like to let her stretch out a little bit. And trust me, this is when it can sometimes get really crazy because she just gets out. And uh, this is when I've taken a few bites from her. So again, let's get this girl out and let her just stretch out for a little bit and play. Okay, she seems like she's okay right now. Uh, all right, guys, let's get her. Let's get her down. Uh, this is when you just never know what she's going to do. She seems to thank you, River. This is when it's scary because she starts to roll. And then when she's starting to roll, you just can't. Watch out, guys. Seriously. Whoa. Guys, you got to help me, guys. Guys, don't let her get away. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, shit. Guys, you gotta get in here. You can't, I can't do this myself, man. Go ahead, get in there. You can't, you guys gotta let me, like, keep with me on this, guys. Like, letting me do this myself is gonna get me in trouble. Okay, let's just see if we can get her to come this way. She's about to get really ugly. You call this a walk? No. Whoa! <laughs> Are you get her head? Get her head! Get her head! Whoa! Whoa! Let her settle down or something. Holy Things are definitely not going the way I'd like them to. She's in a really bad mood. Sometimes she gets like this. It's really scary. Okay. Okay. All right, watch out, watch out, watch out. Wait, just wait a second, guys. She's going to come back on me. No, no, you keep her, keep her, keep her, keep her, keep her. No, I'm saying, wait a second, don't move her. Okay, okay. Me too. Watch out, she's got me. She's... Come on, girl. Calm down. 
calm down, it's okay. As you guys can see, she doesn't cooperate very well. This is definitely an unusual snake. And that's why she'll spend the rest of her days here with us, because this is not a snake for most people. Just let me do it for a second. Whoa, did you see that? No, no. Do it again. <laughs> hang on guys, I need your help now. I need your help now. Grab, 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 grab. All right, just hang on. I don't know where she's at. Okay. Grab it. Watch out, watch out. Whoa. Pull it back, pull it back. Got you. I'm pulling. She's not coming. Hang on, watch out. Watch out. Watch out. Let's go. Oh, they got me. Oh, 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 oh. Keep her in. Keep her head in. Oh. Keep her head in. Oh. Check him, kid. Hook, 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 hook. I know how to do this. Hang on. It broke. You gotta be kidding the back me. Back of it dropped. Well, she's back in her cage, and you think that our nightmare might be over, but right. unfortunately, <laughs> right after getting her back in her cage, we actually broke the hinge off. So we have to roll her out, reattach the slider, without her biting or getting away. Okay, guys, ready? All right, I got her head, guys. Don't worry about her. All right. All right. I, whoa, whoa. Don't worry, don't worry, I got her, I got her. She's all right. Go ahead, I got this side. Don't worry, I'm not gonna let her come out. Come on, calm down, girl. I tell you, every day with Satan is an adventure. George, I swear to gosh, I think this girl's possessed. She is I'm not possessed. Kidding. I'm not kidding, I think there's an evil spirit in her. I'm not kidding you. She's starting to tense up. You almost there? Yeah. Come on, girl, just calm down. Money. Okay, let's get her pushed in. There it is. We finally got her back in her cage. Now, I can't stress enough that the majority of big snakes are nothing like her. I've been working with big snakes since I was 15 years old. This is the first animal that I've ever had that's such a handful. I actually want to show you guys sunshine just so that you understand how cool big snakes can be. As you can see, there's polar opposites when it comes to snakes, and the majority of the snakes that I deal with are this docile. This is my girl Sunshine, and she's another mascot for us. Just as much as Satan is, she's the girl that I take out to kids all the time when I'm doing presentations and stuff like that, and I would never put my son Noah in any danger, and as you can see, she's just super tame. You can take her out, and she's just going to play around all day. So. Again, I don't want you guys to get the impression that every snake is like Satan. As a matter of fact, that's an extremely unusual thing. It's the only one that I've ever had that way, and the vast majority of the big snakes I've had are just like my girl Sunshine, who I love to death. All right, after our adventure with Satan, we really started talking, and we think there actually might be a no, demonic thing possession going on with that with snake. snake. I've yeah. never seen a snake like this before. Chewy wants nothing to do with this Ouija board, but we're gonna get down to the bottom of this. You guys ready? Board, who's the dumbest boss of all? <laughs> oh, look, it does work. Right. Are you ready? Oh, no. All right, we're here asking if there's any demonic possession in our snake, Satan. Can you stop Are you guys me pushing it? No. Stop it. Seriously. Sam. What's it saying? I ain't touching anything, or I'm not moving anything. It's going to Sam. Oh, it went to G? Because I possess Satan. Seriously, you guys touching this? Sam, I'm are not you? doing it. Hey, come on, seriously. I'm not doing it. E, George, holy <laughs> crap! Dude. Uh -uh. Dude, I'm not. You, I you, swear to gosh, I'm not touching snake? this, man. Well, lift up your hands and see if it moves. Yeah, that's you not got, how it, it works. It, yeah, it's got to be channeled through us. It's the demons. George, I think that it's got a problem with you. Guys. You are the one that handles See? it every no. week. You're the you one it's pissed the... off at. Oh? It's all your uh -uh. fault. It's gotta Gio? be George. Gio? What's it gonna say? Metro. <laughs> all right, so you're mad at George. Do you want to kill George? It's gonna go to no. It's gonna go to no. I'm telling you. It's going... <laughs> nah, George, I don't I think swear so. I'm not moving this, George. Are you moving it? Sam! I'm not moving it! It's my wiener. Dude, that... <laughs> George is going to yes. <laughs> Snake wants you dead. Seriously, it went to yes, George. 
<laughs> what the hell have you been doing? What do you do to that snake? Nothing. This hen dog and <laughs> Oh look, it's standing yes. on yes. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, is this <laughs> over with? This is weird. Were you scared? Yes. Gonna jump out and bite you? Yes. No. And you're gonna scream. Oh. Ah! Don't call me later when <laughs> ghosts are eating you or something. <laughs> Where's it going? It's still moving. And you didn't ask it anything. I don't know what it's. I didn't ask it anything. It's just going on its own. K. <laughs> Kesa. <laughs> Who's K? <laughs> Who's wearing here? Casey Dilla. I. What the heck See? is going on? Hey, I got yeah, no nuts. I this snake, I'm serious guys, this snake is freaking possessed. Yeah. Freaking L. <laughs> Kill. I'm about to George, I don't know what we should do. <laughs> I'm done. I'm serious. I, this is scary. I'm not even gonna Hey, you're the who started this whole no, thing. I'm out of here. Get back here, puss ball. <laughs> <laughs> In the semi-final with ball pythons versus carpet pythons, I wasn't too surprised about the results. Of course, ball pythons won. What I was surprised about is some of the backlash against ball pythons because for a while, carpet pythons were actually leading the votes. Now let's go on to the next semi-final. Up until this point, most of the results have been pretty much what I expected it to be, but right from the beginning, this was the matchup I was hoping we were going to see. From here on out, it's going to be incredible to see what you guys decide what the coolest snake is. So this week's death match goes corn snakes versus boa constrictors. I tell you what, I have no idea which one's going to win, but whoever does goes on to the finals against ball pythons, which is going to be another epic battle. The way it's going to work, you guys comment down below, hit me up on Twitter or Facebook. I'm going to tally votes on Sunday, and the winner's moving on to the finals. For this week's comment of the week, the question was, what's something that you dread having to do? And Underbelly said, First off, I'd like to say I find this great show orgasmic. For the question, I'd have to say I dread going to sleep just to wake up an hour later to do something random like slap a chinchilla because it was giving back sass to my sugar gliders. I want chicken nuggets! And Chewy, WTF, Splendiggy Daddy, WTF, burned forever into my lobe. <laughs> that comment had me laughing, but slapping a chinchilla? Here at Snake Bites, we never advocate animal cruelty. I hope you guys enjoyed our battle with Satan and showed you how it was like to just deal with her. And it wouldn't be right unless I shouted out the coolest big snake forum on the net. That's monstersnakesforums.com. Till next time, this has been Snake Bites. Yeah.